Welcome back. Well, we are very excited this morning. Battle of the Badges is taking place tomorrow, the September the 16th. And today we're joined with Will and Seth. They're with the Western Road Police Department, and they are actually fighting in Battle of the Badges. So they're going to tell us a little about it. Guys, thanks so much for joining us this morning. We're excited to have you all here. My pleasure. <laughs> excited to be here. <laughs> Well, can you tell us a little bit about the exciting event that's coming up? Well, it's a yearly event, um, Battle of the Badges, it's police versus firemen. So, uh, this year I believe is about 17 fights and it tallies up police. If the police win, they get a little tally and at the end it's like, you know, who gets, you know, the big trophy, you know, police or firemen. And, um, this year it benefits um, Med Camps Louisiana. Med okay, Camps Louisiana. Cool. Um, so all the money and the proceeds go towards Med Camps this yes, year. Yes, ma'am. Awesome. So can y'all tell us a little bit? First off, is this your first time participating? And also, how did you prepare for this? Well, this is my first time participating. Okay, that's uh, funny. Same here. Same here. <laughs> I had the opportunity to prepare. I went down to Sparky's uh, West Monroe Boxing Club gym, did some okay. sparring. Also got a chance to spar with some guys at the uh, Kron Gracie Jiu Jitsu gym. Other than that, just working on a lot of cardio. Yeah. Uh, been training for about six months. What about you? Yeah, about two months in actually. <laughs> and I was in Sparky's and uh, just been training hard and challenging myself. Never boxed before. It's my first time. And everyone's like, oh, you're big. You need to fight. <laughs> I'm like, okay. So yeah. just doing that. You know, he's, he's sporting a nice little. Yeah. A trophy. So. Okay, a little yeah. battle scars. Yeah. That's yeah, okay. No, that means he's training hard. So. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> so I know you mentioned challenge. How big of a challenge has this been for you all to prepare? It's been huge for me, and you know, I've never boxed in my life, and it's so technical, mm -hmm. but it's very, you know, I'm, I'm an athlete. I played sports in high school, college, and just getting in there to just forgetting everything you thought you knew yeah. and starting from square one, yeah, that was, it was huge. Yeah. But yeah not, I, I don't know about him, but I wasn't prepared for all the cardio that's involved. <laughs> yeah. I'm not a, uh, I'm not real big on cardio. Luckily, uh, yeah. I had some background in, you know, sports in general, but it's a whole nother story getting out there and fighting uh. the cardio and stuff that's involved with it. But yeah, yeah. it's been a lot of fun. I bet. And now, is this a big rivalry between y'all and the fire? Do y'all kind of have a back and forth thing, or is it just from friendly fights? Well, <laughs> there's always a rivalry. Exactly. Right. Okay. You know, perfect. We work together when we always take a little jabs and shots and yeah. stuff. Where I was like, oh, we. But it's always good fun. Yeah, you know, so yeah. It's, yeah, that'll be. We fun all want to win, though. <laughs> yes, for sure. Very competitive. Well, if anyone wants to attend, where can they get the tickets for this event? So they uh, they had it online. With, they go through like Eventbrite. Okay. But um, you can do it at the door, and uh, I believe tickets start selling at like 5 or 5 p.m. or so at the Monroe Civic Center. Okay, perfect. Tomorrow. Awesome. Well, thank you all so much for being here. We're very excited to see how everything goes. Yes. Back to see. Maybe you'll get some more battle scars tomorrow. I don't yes. know. And <laughs> good luck to you all. Yes, well. good luck for yes, sure. Thank you so much. Thank you. Stick around. We'll be right back after the break. <laughs> 